Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Friday the 8th of February. So this one involves, uh, I'm using the uh, Elliott Wave Indicator Suite and the Black Box Breakout Indicator for the Think or Swim Training Platform for this uh, particular signal today. Now, we recently had a massive win on Box on the daily time frame. So I'll just go to that there. Um, Okay, so we were looking for the breakout and the trend reversal through this wave four pivot. We got an entry at 2035, 2023 there. We had the move up and then the big gap up there and had a massive win. I think it was 300% profit times risk. And then it's pulled back over the last couple of days. So what I'm looking for now, I want to use a multiple time frame strategy, which I teach on my um elite training course and I'll put the link uh, in this um, in this video post so what I'm gonna what I've been looking for I've been keeping an eye on it every day on the 60 minute time frame now we've had a wave four pullback let's just move these down a little bit okay so the stochastic as you can see at the bottom here we've got the um, the yellow bar there at the top in the overbought zone that denotes a strong bullish trend and we've pulled back against there on the stochastic. We've crossed over 535 is reasonably good. Uh, more importantly, on this intraday time frame, this wave four has found support at our EMA cloud and our green zone there. The green zone represents an 85% probability it's going to go on. Make that new wave five high, which will be a new all-time high for box, but that it's been going good um, recently. Uh, around about 24.32 there in the middle of that target zone. So really good looking potential fifth wave move. Could hit there today. Most likely though, you must be prepared to swing this over the weekend and pick it up uh, Monday. So we've had this pullback and it's basically tested the low roughly of the gap up there when we had the big earnings move there. So we are looking reasonably good here for a potential fifth wave move. Multiple time frame dark cloud here, all green again. We got a signal in the second to last hour of uh, yesterday's session for a breakout at 2286. Uh, a little bit aggressive for me for the start of this session. Future still negative, although trying to push up uh, during the European morning. Uh, but I've gone for my typical um, fifth wave entry there. So. I'm going to be outside of the 6-4 moving average high for the first bar position of today for the first hour. I'm going to be above the high of yesterday as well. Uh, so sensible entry there. Uh, stop loss 22.29. 23.08 is the entry. So it's above the whole $23 mark, above the high of yesterday and outside the 6-4 moving average high for the first hour's bar position for today. That gives us a risk to reward of 1 to 1 1.6 into our fifth, fifth wave automated target zone up here. Uh, so simple simple looking trade. Again, it's, it's using that multiple time frame strategy. It's about becoming intimate with those stocks that you trade. You have good wins on, they pull back. So we had a great initial black box breakout indicator on the day, on the day and time frame. We, uh, we, well, that was a swing trade. We had great results. It's pulled back there intraday now, and it's about keeping an eye on those and look, using one of our other indicator suites now, the, the uh, Elliott Wave indicator suite with the Think or Swim platform to, uh, to look for that long trade now intraday. Uh, we're going to have to swing it. We're probably going to have to, you know, I very much doubt it will reach that target today. If it has a bullish day, it could reach this previous wave three high. Uh, in which case, if it does, uh, that's a decent little bit of profit there. Take it off. Don't don't risk the weekend, especially with Mr. Trump at the moment. Say he's not going to meet Z before the March deadline for the trade talks and all that. And a lot can happen this weekend. But good looking, strong stock, uh, good looking trade. So I thought I'd share that with you today uh, for box on the outlay for a potential fifth wave move using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. Okay, uh, so check out the link in this post as well for our elite training course uh, where I do teach this multiple time frame strategy amongst lots of other things. Okay, have a great training day, great weekend. Speak to you all on Monday.